My name is Tony Serda. I'm chief of the Costanoan Rumson Carmel tribe. We are a band of Carmel Mission Indians. We come from a village, just a 2,000 year old village in the Carmel Mountains. The last speaker of our language was in 1929, and uh, since that time, the language has been, we've been losing it. And it's, it's something that's very important to us because that's what ties us to the land. Well, our main event is our, is our big time gathering. This is our 24th this year. And the reason that's important is because that's what keeps us going all year. That's what we are able to pay the rent and pay our, our, uh, our things that we do. We do a lot of traveling to do uh, ceremonies and do presentations so that people know we're still here. Because a lot of, a lot of people They've been taught that we're extinct, that we no longer exist. We do these uh, presentations. I don't call them performances because it's a sharing of our culture, which is very important for us to be able to do that. So people know that we're still here. We still have our tribal council meetings that we meet like the second Sunday of every month. And then we have our sweat lodge and we have the meeting. It's a Saturday after the tribal council meeting. It's something that we've lost with the, with the colonization of our people. Our, our right of indigenous occupancy was never honored. Uh, we can't live in the past and we can't be arguing about the past. I think we have to go to the future. And to me, the future is about healing and not hurting. I think that some of the main things that, that we do is work with the colleges, because it's very important. They've helped us quite a bit in the different projects that we got going, especially our language project. To do our programs, we have a, a budget of about $60,000 a year. There's no way we can raise that with one powwow a year. So there's other ways that we have to do to, to, to raise that money so we can keep on going. And, and be able to present our, our, our culture to people so that they learn about us, learn who we are and what we do and what we're all about. So that's a very important thing. And then when people volunteer to show support for, for helping our people do what, what we should do, and they learn from us. Just like we learn from them, they learn from us. Give and take again.